tonight, we're stuffing artichokes. Don't forget, hit that like and subscribe, and let's get started. Okie dokie, artichokey. Stuffing in there. The first thing we're gonna need to do is prep our artichokes. Now, once you start cutting into these guys, they oxidize really fast. So you're gonna want to have a big bowl of water with some lemon juice in it. I just squeezed a whole lemon in there. So once you prep them, throw them in there, stops the oxidization, and keeps them nice until you're ready to go. So let's start cutting up some artichokes. To begin prepping our artichoke, we're gonna get rid of these insignificant leaves down here. You just don't need them. They're not going to do anything for you. But now this guy, the stem, that you want to keep. But we're going to cut it off so that our artichoke sits flat. So what we're going to do is cut off all this rough stuff along the edges anything that's green until all you have is left is white and this stuff is just about as good as the heart of the artichoke it's fantastic so oh, there's a little more green there cut that off and now that's going to go straight into our lemon water so it doesn't oxidize on us now we get to our choke the art of the choke. We're going to go to about an inch down, inch and a half down, and just cut that top part off. Because you got a bunch of prickly stuff up there. It's no good. You don't need that. You don't want to get stabbed in the face while you're eating an artichoke, right? Now, the top of these other leaves, we're going to trim those up with some kitchen shears. Same thing. They got some prickly stuff up there. We'll take an eye out. You don't need that. A couple more. Nothing too difficult. And that's looking pretty good. So we're going to wipe that away. And then we're going to start spreading the leaves. So we want to get to the center of this guy. Okay, now we are in the center. And you see these leaves with the purple on them? They're very sharp. When you get there, you'll feel it because they'll poke you. We want to take, we're going to take that out because these leaves aren't, you're not going to really be able to eat those anyways. You don't have anything to them. So what I'm going to do is get my kitchen shears in there. Just kind of cut away at that. Pull out what I can. Ooh, stuck me a little. And now we got a little bit left in there. See that? So we're going to take our spoon, just kind of scrape that away. You don't want to scrape too hard. or too far down because underneath that is the heart of your artichoke which is I mean the heart of the dish it's delicious see all that fuzzy stuff you can't eat that you don't want that in there might as well fill it up with something that's delicious right so we're gonna get rid of it okay so just scrape that away get all that fuzzy stuff out get down to the heart like so it doesn't have to be perfect either but that's looking really nice right there so we're going to put that into our lemon water prep up our other artichoke and then we'll get to stuffing see 
These are the little nasty buggers I was talking about, and they will get you. It's like a needle sticking into you. Now that our artichokes are prepped, it's time to make our stuffing. I got three cups of breadcrumbs here. We're going to add one and three quarter cups of some Pecorino Romano, grated. And I got eight cloves of garlic, minced. And about a cup of chopped parsley. And mix all that together. Now that that's all together, we're going to add about a half a cup of extra virgin olive oil. Just kind of stir that while we're going. That a good mix. And now we can taste it to see if we need to add any salt. Mm. Yeah. Well, a little salt. Probably about two teaspoons. We're also going to add two teaspoons of some fresh ground black pepper. Give that a mix. And we should be good to go. Our artichokes are ready for some stuffing. So, I'm just going to kind of spread those leaves out a little more. We got this nice hole in the center down to our heart. I'm going to throw some stuffing in there but don't forget we cut that tail off of her cut that in two pieces stick that in the middle and we're just gonna cover that stem with some more breadcrumbs fill up that center Now, what we're going to do is just dump some stuffing into all these leaves. I'm going to do that. I like to just kind of pull and dump. Get some breading. Throw it on there. And while I'm doing it, I like to expand it as well. So let it get all the way down to the bottom. Side leaves. Make sure it's in there everywhere. And you were looking at one hell of a stuffed air joke right there. That's gonna be delicious. All right, so I'm gonna stuff the rest of these guys, and then we'll get to steaming. We got our artichokes stuffed into a nice pot that fits them securely. We're into that pot, we're gonna go with about a cup of dry white wine. Use a Chardonnay. Now this is optional, you don't have to do this. And then we're gonna add water until that gets about halfway up the artichoke. Right there. And now we're going to take a lemon and just squeeze that over the top. Okay, it's time to go to the stove and cook these bad boys. 
We're just gonna bring this up to a boil, and then we're gonna cover it, turn it down to a simmer, and let it simmer until the leaves on these guys get nice and tender. It just got to a boil. Just gonna turn that heat down, bring it to a simmer, cover her up. Now we're gonna let that go until it gets nice and tender. You don't want like the outside leaves to almost be falling off. So we are done. And you may notice that we started with four, but we're at three now. The wife got hungry. We had to feed her, obviously. Happy wife, happy life. But the this, this smell coming off these guys, this thing is one of the most nostalgic dishes for me. I love them. Let's plate it up. There it is. Look at that. You just peel right off. Fantastic. It's amazing. I'm going to go scrape the rest of these leaves with my teeth till I get down to that heart and devour that. You guys have a good night. I'll see you next time.